<clears throat> so tomorrow's the test. Tomorrow's our practical. It's. Oh, shit, I need to change this time. It's uh, 11.48 right now, and uh, everyone's up studying. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh. Honestly, I'm pretty nervous. Like, I'm sweating just thinking about it. Um, it's going to be crazy. There's 52 questions. You have one minute, literally one minute for every question, and that's it. You can't go back. When, as soon as you go in, you have two minutes to write down something, draw something, whatever you want. And then after that, one minute rounds, every station, go, go, go. So I'm going to time myself right now. <laughs> to be honest, I'm not going to, I'm not prepared to like have everything down because I feel like a lot of it's up here, but I am going to draw out the brachial plexus and a couple mnemonics to just help me out. Um, just for careless mistakes. So I'm going to time myself two minutes when the beeper goes off. I'll show you what I have. Right now I have nothing. Blank piece of paper. I'm going to pretend this is like the test. You ready? <laughs> you ready? All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Woo! <laughs> In two minutes, I got this thing. Yeah, I'm trying to find a balance between anxiousness and peace, right? Where you're not too relaxed, but you're not so anxious, where you have just enough stress and anxiety where the stress is good. Um, I think it's called the stress curve or some like anxious curve or something like that. I'm sure all my other classmates right now are staying up, <laughs> studying as much as they can, cramming. Um, unfortunately, we also have a, another quiz on Tuesday, so the day after tomorrow. So it's like, as soon as this is done, you gotta get down and get dirty with the other material. And it is a lot. So nonstop, first term, DPT school, here it is. All right, hey Sullivan, how you feeling? I feel pretty bad right now. How do you feel for the practical that's coming up this Monday? I thought I knew things, but it turns out I know nothing at all. Um, I feel prepared. That's probably because I haven't started studying for it yet. <laughs> I definitely need to study more, but thankful we have those review labs. They keep asking me questions on all the practice ones. I'm like, I knew this, but there's so much stuff that we piled off on top of it that now I gotta like try and dig it out and it's in there somewhere. I'm anxious for it because I, I don't know what to expect and there's a lot, it, every answer is kind of like a total like mouthful of left, right, bone, nerve, artery. And I didn't know a lot of that, so I actually need to start studying for that. I feel like I've learned a whole bunch just in the few weeks that I've been in this, in this so far. But, it's more to know, I guess. Hey, what's the party around here? I'm a little nervous, but I think after being in the lab and just really getting to know each body, it's like the spaghetti meme. Trying to figure out which nerve in the spaghetti. Yeah, I think I'll, I'll rock it all over the place in my process of learning something. And then I hone in and I get that hunted. Get that, <laughs> get that hunted. I feel okay, definitely a little nerve wracking because it's gonna be our first practical. When it comes down to it, like we all know like what structures are in the body. We just can't get too psyched out. It's, it's stuff we know. I feel pretty confident. I think it's all about fine tuning your craft. So I think a little more practice a little more, uh, a lot more time in the books and in the lab, and I think we'll get it done. Like scale of like zero to 10, 10 being like super confident. Let's Where are you at right now? It's about a 7.5. Seven, you mean like a seven plus? Yes. Like a, <laughs> you feel um, prepared? I feel, look at the camera, right? Doesn't matter. Uh, I mean, I feel prepared, um, decently prepared. 
as far as like knowing the muscles, their insertions, knowing uh, the nerves that innervate the muscles, the arteries, the branches, and all that. Yeah, the spaces, I feel pretty confident about that. Identifying it is what scared me a bit. I don't feel too good about the nerve roots because sometimes it just get a little jumbled up. I just need repetition on seeing all the structures and knowing where it branches off of. Tiny bit nervous, enough to motivate me to uh, study more. I only need to keep studying and I still have some work to do. Do you feel scared about the spelling? Yes. <laughs> Very nervous. How about the spelling? How do you feel about the spelling? The spelling? Yeah. Open my eyes. Um, I'm not too worried about spelling. I think I got it. I was in the spelling bee in like third grade. Oh wow, did you win first? No, I got like third. Third place. <laughs> Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, I honestly don't think it's gonna be that bad. I think people are freaking out about it. We have our practical in 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're just waiting out here eagerly. How you feeling, my man? Dude, I'm, I'm a little nervous, but solid. Solid. Same time. Throw anything our way. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good right now. <laughs> Over with. <laughs> I've been ready since Saturday. Oh my gosh. I was ready before the review. <laughs> I'm ready for this. Oh, I have to pee. <laughs> <laughs> what, what are you describing, Dave? Um, everyone during the practice is going to be like. Domo Wani got to Mr. Robot. And this is how people felt after the practical. How was it? Oh. Right after the test. And, uh, oh man. So okay. Yeah. How was it? Uh, right after the test. We're done. <laughs> Yeah, he's got this heart's heart beating like a rabbit. Uh, yeah. It was great. It's over. I blacked out. I have no idea. You blacked out? Yeah, I did. Pretty good. Hopefully I passed. You feel confident? With my left and right side. <laughs> Alright, so overall, not so bad. I think the amount of stress that we've had was good, where it definitely prepared us. First practical was a great experience. Thank you everyone for tuning in to this week's episode. Please stay tuned, please stay updated. Go watch the previous episodes to catch up on what's going on up to this point. If you are behind, watch the episode before of what's going on today. Have a great one, you guys.